Hi everyone, it's Desiree. Welcome back to my channel. Thanks for joining me for another plan with me. Today I'm going to be decorating these mini vertical pages. Um, I have some planners that I was sent from the Happy Planner and sometimes I just like to decorate them. So I just wanted to do a decorate my planner type spread. I don't plan on using this spread. I just, I have fun using my stickers and spreads. And I also like to show how to use planners that I don't typically use. I never, I've never used a vertical planner. I've decorated one spread, this one right here, which it came out really cute. I really love how it turned out. So I want to do another vertical mini spread because I like, I don't know, I just like decorating them. So that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to take these pages out and just decorate this week. And I have some sticker books that I haven't touched in a while, but again, I want, just wanted to use these stickers because I haven't used them in a while. And they are the Socialite sticker books. These are the original the original Socialite ones that came out during the Planner Girl release. They currently have an accessory book that you can still get of this Socialite Girl. Um, I think I've seen it at, I know for sure Joanne's. I want to say Michael's too, but I'm 100% sure. But yeah, I think Joanne's for sure. And I, I think also on the Happy Planner website. But yeah, I want to use these because there's already yellow on the page and there are some good yellow stickers in here that I can pull to tie in that yellow. So I figured this would be a good sticker book. Oh, like that. I love that sticker. <laughs> the florals, I wish they would have had florals in these 30 page sticker books, but for whatever reason, they only put them in this little accessory. Is this an accessory pack or, I always forget what these are called. Um, but yeah, they only have like two little sheets of florals, which is the reason why I have two of these books. I haven't touched this one yet, so. Yeah, I'm going to just use these because I really like them. And I think I also have washing, but I don't know yet if I'm going to add the washing. But, like I said, I'm just going to use these to decorate the page. Actually, I'm going to pull... Where's that yellow sticker I saw? So that was a good one. Or actually, this one's a good one, too, because it has the florals on it and the yellow. So I could add this one over here in the corner just to get some florals on the page. And I actually have a... Um, a washi that has that floral. So I could use that too. Oh, and I think these are when they still put these girls. So I will for sure add one of these girls. I do want to cover this girl up because she doesn't really go with the spread. But yeah. I'm just going to put some stickers down just because it's fun. It's fun to use your stickers. So let's see. Oh yeah, they have this one. Maybe I'll put this one up in this corner see if this will fit actually actually maybe I should have switched yeah I should have switched this one for here since this fits better on this side and then switched put that one over there so I think I'm gonna do that I'm gonna take this off thankfully these stickers come off super easy I didn't even put them on wax paper and they come off very easily I'm gonna put this up here since this fits over here in this section almost perfectly goes over the line a little bit but that's okay and then I'm gonna put this I think I should go down more or just in the line I think I'm just gonna go in the boxes I think that looks pretty I feel like that's enough yellow honestly though because I don't want to add too much yellow I want to add in some other colors I think I have boxes Ooh, I have these. I love using sticky notes as stickers. So I can put this one right here. Sorry, the neighbor's dog is just working like crazy. So I'm going to put a couple of these down. I think that looks cute. Um, I'll, I'll stick those down with or put um, at some kind of tape so that way they don't flop around a little bit. I have these. I could possibly use those. Oh, these are cute. These milled ones. could possibly add that in, but I'm not sure yet where. We have some quotes. I haven't flipped through these in a while, so I don't remember exactly what's in here. I'm just trying to familiar get familiar with these again. Okay, 
Maybe I could do a quote. Okay, I have these. I kind of like this today in one word, just because of the blue. Just to get some blue over here on this side of the page. I'll put that all the way across like that. I need to add some blue on this side, maybe in a box. Or I have these note. I could add a note. I'm kind of decorating this like if it were a functional spread. If I was actually going to use this spread. That's how I try to decorate these, at least to show how it can be. These can be functional. And I'm surprised how many stickers I can fit on these pages. Because it's really tiny. You just have to write kind of small. Probably, but I think it's doable. I can definitely do that. Um, I normally like to add like a like a a box over here on this side. But I don't have any that are small enough because these were for a just a regular horizontal mini. They weren't for a vertical mini. I know there's sticker books that have like vertical mini stickers, but I'm just gonna stick to this one. Okay, so I have these little ones. These are good to use. I like these because you could fit a little icon on top of these. And so like I have a bill, I think I have a bill due here. I'm gonna use purple. This day on the 18th. And it's actually the phone bill. So then you can take one of these little ones and how to get my tweezers but this one is so cute it has a little phone right there and so you can kind of customize it you can make it the same color or you can change it maybe i can do let's see how it looks with blue and i think i'm gonna leave it purple Okay, and then I can put another one. Okay, so I had to close my window because that dog just would not start barking. He's still barking. Um, let's see. Okay, so like I have a payday. I have a payday this day. They have these little payday stickers that are really cute. So I'm actually going to move this note. I'm going to put this here. At least that'll hold that down a little bit. Actually, no. I'll put it there. I'll put it here. And then I could put the payday sticker right here. And then I have another payday this day. So I could do purple. Let's see. I'm going to see the mini for some quotes because they'll just be smaller and hopefully fit better in this planner. Oh, actually, I'm going to pull one of the girls. Maybe this girl will be good. I kind of want to put her over here though. I need to figure out something to cover her up. Okay, so let me try to figure that out actually. Something to put over that girl. I could use some flowers. I do have flowers. I still have a couple in this page, in this book. Oh my gosh, it doesn't want to come off. Okay, there it goes. Okay, I'm going to white her out though because I feel like I'm able to see her through the sticker and I don't want that. So. Okay, I'm just going to white her out. And I think actually I'm going to put the purple sticker, the floral sticker right over here. I 
have to cut that. And should I add this somewhere? Maybe I could put this over here under this sticker. Ooh, actually, I don't like that. Okay, I'm gonna take that off. I'll figure out somewhere else to put that sticker. Okay, for now, I'm just gonna cut this. I want a quote or something. Hopefully, I can find one that can fit in this little tiny section. Oh no, I wanted to put that girl. That's what I wanted to do. We also have these. I think these actually could fit. Okay, I think I'm gonna move this. Thankfully it's just a sticky note. I'm gonna put this over here. That way I can put this quote right there. I'm thinking of adding more florals. Let's see. So I have these little bits. I can add. Just to like fill in this space a little bit because it's kind of empty. I want to put a pink. Oh, I actually have this pink one. I think I might move this. Just a little bit over here. And I think I'm gonna white out this line, this yellow. Okay, so I ended up changing my mind on that quote. I really don't like how it looks there. I don't know why, but I just don't like it there. So I'm going to leave it off. You know what? I think I want to add... I'm going to put this over here just to cover up this mess that I made with the whiteout. So I'll move this down. Put this here. Move this one a little bit more up. Just so it's not like exactly like across from each other. I think that's better. I do want to add the girl in. Let me get her. Let me put her on the page somewhere. I just don't know where I want to add her. Maybe right here probably is a good place. So I'm going to put her here. like moving things around. I'm still getting used to like planning in this planner or decorating this planner because it's it is kind of tricky. It's it is tiny and I don't really know the layout very well. So I feel like in my other planners I always know like where to put things if I'm stuck. So yeah still trying to get the hang of this one but I like trying it out. Alright, so I think, I mean, I do want something on this edge, it's just, I don't really have very much. I do have some checklists. I don't know, maybe I should just add in boxes. 
I have these little boxes. These are tiny. And like this one. I'm gonna put this here. I'll layer this on top. I'll put this back over here. Okay, it's not my favorite, but it'll do. I'm going to add in some of these little bullet points, the yellow ones, just to tie in some more yellow around the page. And then I have some other colors too. I can do pinks, the blue. Let's see where we want pink. Pink right here. Do a blue. Okay. Not horrible. So that's good at least. Um, and then I still, like I said, I want something for over here. Just don't know what to put there. Okay, I found this, remember this, in this pack right here. I think I wanna use this one for the sidebar. I would prefer to have like a box or something, but I don't have a box. So, and I don't feel like putting bullet points because I feel like it'll just take up so much room on this side that, I don't know. Maybe I could try adding bullet points if I can get this down straight. Okay, so let me see. There's I know there's bullet points in here. Oh, I like these. I should have used these. Oh well. Okay, so I have these bullet points. I'm thinking of using the triangles, the blue. So let's see how this looks here. It doesn't look horrible. So I'm just going to put a couple, or maybe I'll just put four down this side. Probably should have counted and spaced them out evenly, but actually, no, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't know why I don't like that. Even though I don't plan on using it, I just, I like to decorate it the way, like if I was using it. So I'm going to try to find something to put on that sidebar because I don't like the way that looks. Okay, so I don't know how this is going to turn out, but I'm thinking of taking this box right here since it's a graph paper type box and cutting it to make it fit in this section, just so I have a box here, because I really want a box. So I'm gonna cut this in half. Thankfully I have like little grid lines to help me cut this in half. All right guys, yeah, so I'm just gonna do it right in the middle. I probably should have done it off to the side though, honestly, now that I think about it, but, oh well. Okay, so I'm thinking of putting this here somehow. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna put this here. I'm gonna try to go as close as I can to the edge because I want it to be wide enough for this area. Okay, so that's going to go down right here, and then I'm just going to piece this back together. 
and hope that it doesn't look ridiculous. I don't think it will. Yeah. It's a lot. Alright, so I'm going to put this Remember This back. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot, but I think at least I have a box, which is what I wanted. I'm actually going to flip this, just the way the flowers aren't like all near each other. I feel like this will look better over here. This is not turning out how I thought it was going to turn out, but that's okay. Um, I don't know, it looks a mess. That's why I feel. So I'm just going to add more stuff because it already looks really cluttered. So why not just add more stickers to it? Oops. Okay. It doesn't look horrible. <laughs> but it doesn't look great either, in my opinion. I don't know. It's a lot, but put a lot of stickers on there so that's good to know. I'm just gonna tape down I'm just gonna tape down this sticky note. This one too. I think what I'm going to do with this, because I really don't like that bow, is I'm going to cut this off, this point off, and just have this box, just so it says remember this, and then put this back over here. I think this might look a little better over here on this side, like that. Okay, yeah. I think that looks so much better. All right. I think that's it. I have a lot going on. Yeah. It's a lot. But I love these stickers, so it was nice to use them again. I need to use them actually in my, one of my spreads, but it's just so many sticker books are coming out and I have so many sticker books that it's hard to use everything. So that's why sometimes I just like to use them even if I'm not going to use the spread because I like doing that. So I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more of my videos, please hit that subscribe button and I hope to see you guys all in the next one.